When I first started with the Terry Fox Student Helpers years ago, uh, it was students who came to me. They saw that I had a lot of paperwork, I was trying to collate together, get envelopes organized, sort tattoos or stickers, and they asked if they could help when they were finished their work, and it grew from there. I volunteered to become a Terry Fox Helper because I wanted to be involved in the school community when I was in grade four and also because my Nana died of cancer when I was in grade one. I became a Terry Fox ambassador because it's, it's a great cause to be involved in knowing that everyone in this room, like everyone that's become involved in it has been touched by cancer at some point. And if they haven't, knowing that when you one day will be, that it's just great to know that go, looking back, you actually did something to help. The thing about Terry Stream that made me want to join this club is you and very far across Canada on one leg, which most people wouldn't even do that with both legs. So he's just an amazing person. We've noticed a huge impact of having a Terry Fox ambassador program at our school. Uh, one of the biggest differences, I mean, we really want to have students who are leaders. Uh, we want students who are good community members. But we can talk about what it means to be uh, somebody like that. But to actually have a program in place where the kids can, can carry out their best wishes and can carry out their good intentions, uh, it's phenomenal. We did the banner that we made. We made those during our free time, during recess, and we choreographed the dance to show the little kids. And we did warm-ups in the beginning so of the Terry Fox run so that the kids would be all like energized so they could start running right away. The banners were the funnest thing to do because they were easy to do and a lot of kids like to, they like started taking pictures with it and things like that. We raise money for cancer research like we do a bunch of incentives so when we raised 15,000 we got extra recess we make lemonade so we have a lemonade stand in this in September and in the summer and we have hot chocolate in the winter and we just raise a bunch of money and it all goes to the Terry Fox Foundation. By having them um, at the front end of it and helping throughout the whole thing, it makes more participation from the whole student body the whole way through, not just on that day. And then they went around and they helped collect money, they helped track forms, they stamped things. They, they were in it from the beginning to the end. So it was a, a lot more involvement from the upper grades in the school, which is really important. It makes me feel really good and a good person because I'm helping people that don't really have an option to not have cancer and I just feel really proud of myself for helping out and just making people's lives better. There's definitely been a huge increase in the donations and the students involved from when it first started. Like you can tell that people are getting inspired by the ambassadors and just the teachers that are getting involved and all the other people from the Terry Box Foundation coming and inspiring the kids. It's a better school when, when we have a Terry Fox school team because people f it makes people feel better about the school. Why? Because um, it's because like people um, when people see students helping other people they feel like it's good and it feels good in your heart. If another school wanted to start a Terry Fox Club, I'd encourage them so that we could find a cure for cancer. I think it's wonderful. I think if any teacher is thinking about should I have Terry Fox student helpers or not, definitely just try it. It's worth a shot. Nothing bad is going to come of it. There's going to be so many wonderful positive experiences and it's really good.